just ask you one two questions about your experience in Millennium Water Alliance. And uh, I'm here at uh, German AgroAction to know how you fared in the last few months with the Millennium Water Alliance. Okay, thank you, Elijah. Yeah, uh, my experience at MWA has been very interesting and it's a learning experience. I've been there now, it's my fourth month. And I work with Doris and Violet. Yes. And I've been able to have a lot of interaction with the project, with the WASH project. I've visited the field. I was in Marsabit. I interacted with the Three Armas initiative. You just mentioned about Three Armas study. What is it about? Could you kindly briefly tell me about it? I was more involved with the MAS, which is the multiple use services, mostly for it's about water in the domestic, at the household level, for livestock and for vegetation. And uh, what do you think are the major findings about your study with the Milena Motor Alliance team? Yes, we were able to find out that what is very important for multiple use in the households because they need it at their household level and even for their livestock because they are mostly pastoralists yes, and for yeah. vegetation and farming. Thank you for that. Uh, especially in Masabit, the, the, the multiple use services for water is really in, in, in great need. Yes. And uh, w what do you think could like uh, FH really focus on mm -hmm. to ensure that the multiple use services of water is enhanced? Yes, we actually visited a Kamboi village in Logo Logo. We found out that the people are very excited about the boat mass. So it's a good initiative. FH should carry on and uh, help them, support them in starting maybe with the greenhouses for farming and for supporting them to get the, to the project, the, wash, the new wash project that they are involved in. I've been able to go to the field. I was in Marsabit with the TR mass team. I was more involved with the mass team, which is the multiple use services. That is household, that is water, in the, the household level, and even the livestock are able to access water and for farming. What were, major, were the major findings from your team? Yes, for the mass team, we were able to find out that the mass is very effective, it should be very effective in Marsabit, because as you found out, the people living in Marsabit, they are mostly pastoralists, so they depend on their livestock. They require much water for their livestock also, and for farming. And do you think the findings are important for FH, the, the partner you came to support? Yes, they are very effective because you're able to find out that they really did require the mass for them to, to help the community. We visited the Kamoe village and Logo Logo village, rather location. Maybe we were able to find out that they really they need of of support to be able to start the mass in the initiative, whereby maybe FH can support them in digging boreholes or repairing the the existing boreholes and stand dams for them for their livestock, for their farming, and also for the household level. Yes. Yeah, uh, experience has shown that uh, Kampo is an area that uh, has good potential of water, underground water, but due to the many boreholes that are there and the poorly managed, and that's why we'll be able to select this area so that we'll be able to see what better we can do in terms of supporting the three R's and the mass study. Mm -hmm. So I agree with you, as uh, you have mentioned, that uh, FH has a role to play mm -hmm. in ensuring that integrated water management services in that Kampo is, is better done in the future, especially under this program. Yes. Thank you for your short interview.